I'm going to show you some proof in this video today uh, that Jews, any kind of a powerful Jew, is a servant of the Vatican. Um, I get so sick and tired of hearing these people, the, the anti-Jewish, anti-Zionist people and whatever else, and they, almost every case, they don't talk about the Vatican. Everything in the world that's wrong is the fault of the Jewish people. But they never, they're, they're too stupid to see that Jews are under the authority of the Vatican. Okay, the Jews don't control the world. Okay, unless you have rocks for brains. The Jews are servants to the Vatican. That's what the Bible teaches. Mystery Babylon is a city that reigns over the kings of the earth. The Jews don't have a city. Okay, that's ridiculous. And you say, well, Jerusalem. Then why are they giving part of the Jerusalem over to the Vatican? But uh, if you need proof, if you're falling for these lies, then here's your proof. This man right here, Gary Krupp, right there he is. This guy, <clears throat> he's working literally to bring about the Antichrist system. I will show you the proof in this video. Here he is, Gary Krupp, whatever, a Jewish ally in debate over Pope Pius XII. Right there he is sitting beside Benedict. Okay, Cardinal Ratzinger, Joseph Ratzinger, now, now Pope Benedict. There he is shaking the hands of Benedict. Oh, the Jews rule everything. Stupid. There he is again. Him and his wife. Highly knighted. Uh, all these different knighthoods of the Vatican. And you know, you can get down through. Here he is with uh, Pope John Paul II right there. And there's Gary Krupp again. I mean, there's so many pictures of the guy you can show. All these different things, you know. Him and his wife meeting with different Vatican officials and archbishops and whatever else. <clears throat> guy, this guy sickens me. This guy's going to fry in hell. It's just, it's, talk about, you know, backstabbing your own people. Pave the Way Foundation, right? Headed by Gary Krupp. And you can get down through here, you can read the whole thing here. It's an interreligious, you know, thing of, uh, <clears throat> is a non-sectarian organization whose mission is to identify and eliminate non-theological obstacles between religions. All right? And they they let's let's bring all religions together under the Vatican's authority. That's what they're doing. And um, basically he's trying to create peace between the Jews and the Vatican. That's what the Antichrist does. And this guy's not the Antichrist, he's just a servant of the Antichrist. He's disgusting. But you get down through here um, he's trying to, another thing he did, he wrote a book about uh, Pope Pius XII. He wasn't really in league with the Nazis, and he wasn't really, you know, persecuting the Jews. He was actually trying to help the Jews, and there's even Catholic priests that are coming out and saying, this isn't true. What are you doing? You're just lying. I mean, even Catholics are going against this guy, saying you're totally lying about him. But you get down through awards accepted by Gary Krupp on behalf of Pave the Way Foundation. You know, gets a, a, there's one from the Muslims, right there. Jerusalem Medal of the Franciscan Custody of the Holy Land. I thought, thought the Jews ran things. What are the Catholics doing there in Jerusalem, giving awards out? Huh, yeah. Some of you neo-Nazi neo idiots out there, your fascist neo-Nazi idiots. Everything's the Jews. Oh, it's the Jews. You're stupid. It's a Catholic church. Order of Knighthood. Ordered by Pope John Paul II. You know, Order of Knighthood by Pope Benedict, Benedict XVI. But here's the big one down here. <clears throat> Knight of the Grand Cross and Dame of the Grand Cross of the Pontifical Equestrian Order of St. Gregory the Great, located in Jerusalem. Oh, he's a Jew and the Jews run the world. Yeah, okay. No, he's a, he's a papal knight. Here you have uh, Pave the Way Foundation, their website, our projects in the field of obstacles and controversy, working to introduce a balanced and mindful dialogue to impact the obstacles that obstruct peace and positive relations amongst religions. Yeah, okay. Improving Israeli-Christian relations. They mean Catholic relations. That's what the Antichrist is going to do. He confirms the covenant with many for a week. Right? This guy's literally a servant of the Antichrist. So just wanted to make a real quick video about this because I get so sick and tired of the of the vile filth that comes from things. You know, here they are. This guy here is a Holocaust denying Catholic bishop, well known for his Holocaust denial. I've made videos about the guy. You know, and oh, we'll defend him. Oh, he's he's not so bad and whatever. 
This this guy here, this sick man right here, stabs his own people in the back. The Jews that were destroyed in the in the death camps and whatever else. Of course, if he was alive at the time, he wouldn't have been because he was a rich Jew, a wealthy Jew, in bed with the Vatican and the Catholic Church. So they would have just kind of ferreted him off to America or whatever else. Like a, a lot of the high-level Masonic Jews, they only killed the low-level ones in the death camps. But I get so sick and tired of this stuff. So, you know, and I get it in the comments and things. I used to comment. And, you know, I, I comment on videos and things and check out the Jesuits and I'll get people ready. It's not the Jesuits, it's the Jews. The Jews, the Jews control the Jesuits. Yeah, okay, whatever. Um, Lord help you. If you're, if you're one of these papists that just blames the Jews for everything, um, you're stupid. You're willingly ignorant, especially after watching this video. Uh, here's a high-level Jew, and he's in bed with the Vatican, defending Pope Pius XII. So that's going to be it for this video. If you're still deceived in it, well, then you don't have the Holy Spirit of truth. It's just that simple.